It's been exciting. It's very educational. I get joy. I don't know. I get joy when I think about, and then it's also expressing ourselves to society to let them know that we're somebody. You know, and even though challenges come in our lives, it comes in everybody's life in different ways. Prior to her mental illness, uh, she was involved with uh, trauma. Uh, it was very devastating for her. And one of the ways that she came to deal with trauma was to expose it, expose it to an adult. And expose it in general is probably the best way because she learned to help herself through uh, telling somebody about it. And she also learned that faith and forgiveness played a major part in her transforming uh, her trauma and resolving some of her trauma. If there's anybody that's having a mental challenge, that they'll be brave enough to speak out. So let them know that they're not the only one on the earth or in society or community that's going through that. It's somebody else that goes through the same thing they do. It's just that we're scattered out so far from each other to where we don't know. It takes a lot of courage for someone to really be honest and to open up, you know, those things because pain, it hurts. You know, nobody likes pain because it's too hurtful to really share your emotions and your experience because it's devastating. It's devastating trauma. What it does, it 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 messes. Uh, it can really mess up a person's psyche. And what that means is, it can it, it can really it can really mess up like your whole being, your whole wellness, your whole sense of purpose, your whole concept, your self-esteem, your self-worth, your self-values. And for people to actually take a stand against that is actually a good strength to have. One thing is to save lives. So if you have suicidal thoughts, sometimes if you see another person going through what you're going through and can identify, sometimes that sparks them that we want to keep life and stay alive. Oh, I love piano playing. I think it's um, exciting. I think it's um, an instrument that sounds so pretty and melody. It relaxes me. It makes me confident. It makes me see um, brighter days. I like Ara very much. Uh, she's a very uh, unique individual in her own respect. She's very kind, caring. She's very honest. She's very forthcoming. Uh, she is she is a survivor. I expected to come down here to really find out who I really am. And from doing that, it showed me that I'm educated more than what I thought. I underestimated myself. Mm -hmm. So I enjoyed the experience. I enjoyed being educated. I also learned a little bit about audio. See, it's different things that came my way, and I thank God for that.